in the foggy shopping district. Damn it. Again? <laughs> First, I heard the doorbell ring. But when I opened the front door, I saw no one there. Just as alarm bells sounded in my mind, someone grabbed me roughly from behind and covered my mouth with something. What? Damn. Immediately afterward, I was put into something like a sack and most likely carried on the culprit's shoulder. The culprit seems to have used a chemical to incapacitate me, but luckily I wasn't completely unconscious. Damn. I had been expecting a trick along those lines, so I was somewhat prepared. Damn. I felt a single impact, which I assume is when I was thrown inside the TV. But the time from kidnapping to that point seemed too short. It was a matter of minutes. So they have a car? Maybe? And in the trunk of a car, there's a TV? I'm not saying you should have caught him, but isn't it kind of sad for an ace detective to go down that easily? What is wrong with you? Um... Um... To tell you the truth, I was really scared. Of course you were! Because you have a brain! I'm like this guy over here. My god. Yeah, Yosuke, you know what? You go on TV next. I'm sorry. It can't be helped. Alright, Yosuke, I'll get you an interview. Don't worry. <laughs> Let me get you an interview with the local TV station real quick. None of us could resist the culprit either. Don't forget, Naoto-kun is younger than us, and she's a girl. Oh yeah, that's true. I keep forgetting when I see her talking like this. You know, Naoto, <laughs> you got balls. For a girl. <laughs> Why does this make me angry? <laughs> Why does this make me mad? We can only watch and wait for him to make the next <laughs> move. <it's> so <laughs> Nanako doesn't seem to be home. I'm home! Oh my god, welcome back. <sighs> there was a letter in the mailbox for you. The sender's name and address are nowhere to be found. Oh shit. It's gonna say... Watch your back. <gasps> oh, calling card! Joke. She discusses with the group tomorrow? Yo, what the heck? <gasps> scared the shit out of me, my god! Death Note? I'll protect you all from the madness of this world. I'll take you to a place where you can be at peace. What? That was scary. Showed everyone the letter you received yesterday. No punctuation or capitalization. Aw, oh, what a cliche. <laughs> That's where she is. That's where you're looking, girl. Did you show this to your uncle? No. This is actually a very big... <sighs> if you just told Dojima on everything now, then I think he would help you. But I have to think in the context of the game. I don't plan to. I'm thinking logically, but games don't think logically. But how could the killer know so much about us? Because they're right under your nose. Could he be watching us from somewhere? Freaking out over speculation is just what the killer wants us to do, right? Yeah. We'll have to wait until the situation changes. All right. Mind if I change the subject then? The culture festival's just around the corner. What's our class doing again? Maid cafe, maid cafe, maid cafe, maid cafe, maid cafe. Oh yeah, it hasn't been decided yet, huh? Hey senpai, have you decided who you'll be going oh. around the campus with during the festival? My schedule's still wide open, you lucky guy. I'll take you up on that offer. She just had to say something. Well... I got a phone call from dad. He's coming home. Big bro, can you make a salad? I eat salad for breakfast. What if she's like, and you don't want it for dinner? Sure thing. Right 
then. You can be the salad maker. And I'll be the, um, the egg sunny side up maker. Cute. A well balanced <laughs> diet is important. So cute. My teacher said that families help each other. You're my family too. So let's work hard together. Cute. Let's do it. Yeah. Let's get a picture of you and me and dad all oh. together one day. I love you, big bro. Oh, I love you too, Nanako. Oh. I love you too, Danako! Oh, she's so cute, so precious. Ah, that was so wholesome. That's so wholesome. It's time for homeroom. Well, as you all know, next week is the Culture Festival. Maid Cafe? And as you also know, we still haven't decided what our class is going to do for it. Oh my god, Yosuke, don't put your hand up. We are going to decide based on the suggestions we have so far. Break area, video room, and study room. Oh, one more. Um, group date cafe. Hey, who put in a suggestion like that? <laughs> no! Yeah, it's just a joke idea. You gotta have one weird one mixed in, you know? Ah, figures! <laughs> I feel like this is the illusion of choice. Guess what's gonna win? <laughs> it's not for me. All right, time it's to for count everyone the votes. else. <laughs> All the votes have been counted. The group date cafe is in first. Well, first place? What are we gonna do? I've never been on a group date before, so I was a little curious. <laughs> no way, Yukiko voted for it too! What the? You voted for it? Yeah. I thought it would be sad if no one voted for it. Oh my gosh. How the heck's this gonna turn out? <laughs> Good morning. Sorry to barge in. Yosuke forced himself under your umbrella. Make room for me too. This one's already full, dumbass. Can't nod to the make room under hers. Uh, what? Me under me and her under the same umbrella? Tell with that. If I did that, um, it'd mean we pra <laughs> we'd practically be like a couple. And that's a problem because... Dude, how old are you? Shut up! Come on, let's trade spots. You know how stupid that sounds, right? Hey! H hey! Who are you calling stupid? Stop talking shit about me! Ugh, will you just make up your mind? Excuse me. Um, I don't mind making room for whoever. Oh! Ah, yeah. I... Three? No, I'm a, I'm a wingman. <laughs> Be a type fit under Park's umbrella. Not just perfect for you. Huh? Perfect? <laughs> Me and Naoto are perfect? Ah, damn it. I don't need an umbrella and a damn drizzle like this. I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> can you Shh. That idiot's gonna make himself sick. That was so good. Headline written in large letters on the bulletin board. Miss Yasogami High Pageant. Ugh, on top of planning it, Kashiwagi's gonna be in it? Oh my god. See a list of familiar names. Yukiko! Chie! Rise! Naoto? What? Wow. Yukiko-san's finally entering. Finally? Uh-oh. Finally? Uh-oh. That means... <laughs> no! Why? Why does... Why is he so evil? <laughs> Look, Chie's entering too. 
She's actually pretty close to my type. What does that mean? Pretty close to my type? What does that mean? Naoto's that boyish, girlish, whatever, right? You know, she's, uh, pretty cute. <laughs> no! Dude, you sound like a pervo when you laugh like that. <laughs> but to be honest, I think she's cute too. <laughs> no! <laughs> you better have a damn good explanation for this! For what? The beauty pageant! You wrote down our names without telling us, didn't you? <laughs> I mean, you guys know how popular Yukiko is here. And on top of that, we have an idol and a detective prince. What about she? Hey, you want them to be in it too, don't you, Kanji? Huh? I ain't interested in that stuff. <laughs> Naoto-kun, Kanji-kun says that he really wants you to be in it. I'm gonna go insane! I'm gonna go insane over this game! Oh my god! <laughs> what? I, I, I didn't say nothing! What about you? You want them to be in it, right? <laughs> to the pageant, damn it! <laughs> no, not three. Sigma three? That's right. That's the way to go. Teddy's looking forward to it too. Actually, I think he was more excited than anyone. It was him who was pushing me to sign you all up. Is this what they talk about at night? Yosuke is like, there's this thing called a beauty pageant and explains it to Teddy. And Teddy is like, oh, Yosuke, make them sign up for it. But it seems ill-fitting for someone <laughs> like me to get up on stage. Uh, I don't think it's a problem at all. <laughs> no! What are you saying? <sighs> um... I beg you, please be in it. <laughs> what the fuck? What? If you do, my uh, doubts no! will finally be cleared. Oh, shut the fuck Come on. Make me a man. <laughs> please. Doubts? What are you talking about? Oh my god, poor Naoto. Look, just, just do it, damn it. I mean, I mean you're an ace detective, aren't you? <laughs> What does that have to do with a beauty pageant? <laughs> He's dying! He's dying! <laughs> uh oh. The Miss Yasugami High pageant. Oh. <laughs> Stop. They're doing the cross-dressing pageant again this year? Man, they never learn, do they? <laughs> Ooh, some people have signed up already. <laughs> Man, what idiots would want to be in this thing? Let's see. Yosuke Hanamura... <laughs> Me?! Wait, and Kanji Tatsumi? Oh, no! You're on here, too! Pork? I heard this year, even if someone else signs you up, you can't back out. Well, that's not cool. Hey, but what if they did sign themselves up? Ew, what a disturbing thought. <laughs> Seriously, that's really wrong. It's so funny, because like for the time, it might have been right. But in this day and age, people would be like, oh, hell yeah, sign me up. <laughs> The times have changed. 